going to start off with one pound of shrimp. One pound of shrimp is usually like about $13 or so. I like to tell you guys how much it is because I know before I cooked, I didn't know how much certain things were, especially seafood. And I was like, mm, I don't know if I want to buy it. Is it too much money? So $13, but that's a pretty good amount. So we're going to pour that into a bowl. And I know the shrimp looks really disgusting before you cook it. It's really nasty. But I promise when we cook it up, we're going to make it really delicious. So I'm going to use two teaspoons of Emerald's Original Essence. You can also make this. You can use, um, I think it's garlic powder, paprika, and there's a few other spices in there, but I thought it was easier just to buy it. So, Plus, I like emerald. you got to support my man. And just pour it on top of your shrimp and give it a light little toss so all the shrimp gets that nice flavor. And we'll let it sit for a minute while our butter melts. So in the back, I just have a pot of water boiling for my linguine that I'm going to cook up while I do the shrimp. And I just have my butter melting over high heat. Then we're going to drop the shrimp in on one side. The butter's melted, so we're just going to add in our shrimp on one side. Make sure your pan is nice and hot. We're going to cook it for about two minutes on this side. Then we're going to flip them over and cook one the other side. It's a little bit crispy. They look like real shrimp now. Real shrimp that you'd want to eat. Ooh, look at that one. Then I'm just going to add in about one tablespoon or so of garlic that I minced up. So it's about one or two garlic. Now we need to deglaze the pan a little bit. See how on the bottom the shrimp stick and there's brown? That's flavor. So we want to get all that up. We're going to add in two tablespoons of butter. I know, more butter. And then about a quarter cup of lemon juice. So I'm just going to add in some dry white wine. I'm just going to do it straight from the bottle. You don't even need to measure. It's about half a cup. Pour it right in over your shrimp. And then we're going to drain our pasta and add everything all together. Then add in half a teaspoon of salt, and half a teaspoon of pepper. The shrimp is all finished and it smells really good in here, so we're just going to add in our linguine that I cooked. And we're just going to add in the rest of our butter. It's two tablespoons. Then we're going to do half a cup of the pasta water that we reserved. That's going to keep everything nice and give it a good texture so the pasta doesn't dry out. You don't want it to be dry. Then we're going to add in a quarter cup of scallions. And you can use crushed red pepper, but I'm like, ooh, that thing is hot. I set it on the stove. Not a good idea. Then I'm going to add in some um, ground pepper, cayenne pepper. Just a little pinch or so because it's really strong. Mm -hmm.